Well, it's September 16th here in Minnesota, and I'm out trying to get a doe tag filled tonight. It's very hot, um, mid-80s today, and uh, definitely not the type of night that you'd be out trying to target a buck on. But I want to get my doe tags filled before the cold front rolls in so I can focus on bucks then. So let me show you the setup I'm hunting over. All right, so directly behind me, I got this large pond and it's hot tonight. So obviously on nights like this, if you got a good water source and you wanna go deer hunting, that's kind of the spot to hone in on. So I got this big, beautiful pond behind me here. Let's see, it runs quite a ways that way. Now I anticipate I'll see the deer kind of filtering out right here. Oh my, there is a slight chance, I didn't realize this pond was this low, a slight chance they come right under me right here, hopefully not. I have a south wind so my scent is blowing right over the pond, so I'm hoping they don't sneak along this edge. But I got this spot here. My most likely shot is going to be here because the food plot is right up there. That's where they're going to try to get to. And then I also got the funnel kind of coming right here. Now see on this stand, I got a couple like this. My poor man stands. There was a seat at one point, but it rotted away. So it looks like I'll be standing at night. I'm also rocking the world's okayest hunting shirt just just trying to get a little bit of street cred yeah this little looks to be a deer trail right here is making me a little bit nervous especially on a hot night they might i think they're gonna go to water first so we'll see what happens my scent's blowing kind of like that so they might not quite pick up on it especially that close Well, no doe tonight. Um, I ended up seeing four little bucks, one doe. I didn't get one of the bucks, and I did not get the doe on camera, but she didn't give me a shot. So, uh, fun fun to see the deer, fun to see those little bucks fighting. Um, fun to hear the one buck drinking water behind me. Still a good night out in creation, but I guess I'll just have to get back at it. Uh, I don't know if I'll get back out for a doe before this cold front hits, but the next time I hit stand and maybe going for a buck we'll see when i get back out so i didn't do any kind of pre-hunt interview my second hunt of the week but we were sitting the bottom side of a ridge not too far off of bedding but a spot we can get into clean and we had deer in front of us the moment we sat down until the moment we left we had two fawns actually bedded in the shooting lane and somehow me and my son were able to get into that deer stand with those fawns bedded 60 yards away um, but I didn't get much video just because I had deer on top of me all night couldn't set up my little stand for my phone that I record my videos on but um, yeah still a fun night Ton of, tons of deer I think we saw five different bucks and uh, seven does and fawns so really good set